Hey everyone, I'm going to show you on how to set up your Roxio Game Capture HD Pro using a desktop PC instead of a gaming laptop. The method is pretty simple and it's fast. First of all, the equipment you're going to need. Uh, you're going to need your Roxio Game Capture HD Pro. This is the, the get capture card. You're going to use the USB cable. Um, this is the power supply. This is supplied with the Roxio Game Capture. You're going to need two monitors or TVs. You'll need your game system, either the Xbox One, Xbox 360, doesn't matter. Three HDMI cables and then your desktop PC tower. Alright, so first off, get your Roxio Game, uh, Game Capture HD Pro and find all the cables that you need. So the first thing you're going to need is your USB cable that's supplied with the Roxio Game Capture HD Pro. And you're going to want to plug that in to the back of your tower someplace. You're also going to need an HDMI cable from your PC tower to one of the monitors. This will be the t monitor that you're doing all of your recording and editing on. Second, you'll need another HDMI cable for your secondary monitor. This will be the monitor or TV that you are playing your Xbox on. And third, you'll need your HDMI cable from your Xbox One or other game system. Alright, so now let's start plugging things in. The USB cable is going to go on to the output side of the Roxio Game Capture HD Pro. Plug this in and you're going to see a bright blue light up there in the top right corner. Now let's plug in the HDMI cable from your secondary monitor into the output side of the Roxio Game Capture HD Pro. Now finally, take your a a game system HDMI cable and plug it into the input slot of the Roxio Game Capture HD Pro. This is what the final configuration looks like. All right. Now we're going to want to open the Roxio software. So uh, open this up and you're going to come up with a screen that says Capture and Edit and Share. We're going to want to click on Capture, but first let's turn on our game system. You'll know it's working correctly when the Xbox symbol or PlayStation 4 symbol shows up on the screen. This means that you are connected every uh, that you connected all the HDMI cables properly, and the Roxio Game Capture HD Pro is actually working. All right, so now let's click on Capture. This will sometimes happen where it won't register. If you come up with a blank screen like this, just exit out and then click on Capture again. You'll see you get a, l a little loading circle. This means that it's working, and now there you go. You can see that you can start capture right there. When you click start capture, it will start recording the screen uh, that you're playing your Xbox on. And then when you stop your capture, your video will go into the bottom uh, bottom tray down there. And from there, you can edit it and uh, adjust it however you want. All right, guys, that ends it for this video.